Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm gonna to show you guys how to set up your lab for the water cycle. Some materials you're gonna need are a glass beaker, a clear bowl, a paper towel, some water, some saran wrap, and some ice, All right? So the first thing you're gonna do is take your glass bowl and you're gonna to have to come over to the supply station with me, all right? Because you're gonna to need to get some hot water, all right? So you're gonna come over here and I'm gonna pour some hot water into your bowl. All right. Next, you're gonna come back to your lab station and you're gonna take your beaker, okay? Now, you wanna grab your paper towel or your tissue and you really wanna make sure it's completely dry, that there's absolutely no water inside of our beaker. And we're gonna take our, our very dry beaker and we're gonna put it inside of our glass bowl, all right, around the water, okay? And kind of set it up so it's in the middle. Let me slide this backwards so you can see it. And once you've gotten through that point, you're gonna have to come back to the supply station again, okay? And I'm going to give you some saran wrap and some ice, all right? So, unroll the saran wrap and what you're going to do with your saran wrap is you'll end up stretching it over the top of your bowl. I'm sorry you can't see my face the whole time. Cutting my cute face off. Alright, so you're going to stretch it over the top of your bowl. So what we're creating here is like an atmosphere, all right? So imagine that our bowl of water is like the ocean. And we have an atmosphere over our ocean, just like we have an atmosphere in, in real life, okay? So that's our saran wrap, our atmosphere, okay? Then, again, you'll have to come back to the supply station for this. But next you're gonna need some ice, all right? So I don't know if you guys know this, but if you get really high up in the atmosphere, it's actually really cold up there. So for us to create an atmosphere in our bowl, we're gonna take some ice cubes and we're gonna place it on top of our beaker, all right? All right, that's all the setup you have for this lab today. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to set your bowl aside and you're going to wait for a little bit, okay? And what we're going to do is see if we have any water appear in that beaker that, that we dried out very well, made sure there's no water in it from the start, all right? So later on in lab, after we've given it some time, we're going to come back to our lab setup and, and take a look at our beaker to see if anything's changed. Let me know if you have any questions today.